Hey guys, Billy Jenkins here for Silver Creek Doodles. Today's video, I'm actually sitting down because we're going to be talking about how Miss Purple from Millie and Pickles Litter, the F1B Petite Aussie Doodles, our last black phantom girl, how she found her home. So Miss Purple, this precious girl right here. So she was with us until after she was a little over nine weeks old, but I wasn't complaining because she was so sweet. But the thing, so we were gonna start doing a video. One day I was sitting down at my computer, getting one video together of another litter that went home or weekly updates or something. And I was sitting at the computer and I'd already planned, we needed to, you know, get her bathed up in, get her blow dry, look in like, prim and proper, and we were gonna take her out and start socializing her. When we have puppies here that are over eight weeks old, we don't just like keep pushing them off and like forgetting about them. We've got to do the work like they're in our home, like they're our new puppy, just because we, we're not gonna make these puppies, you know, miss out on that just because we haven't found a home yet. So I got a text message from a lady that said, hey, we're from California, but we're in town. We're headed to Florida. We're gonna be here a few days. They're in Asheville, about 45 minutes from us. And they wanted to come down and meet us and see the dogs and see the facility and stuff like that. When we have puppies on the ground and we've got litters and we had a new litter that was just born and we couldn't exactly have people come and walk through and get all of our dogs, not really upset, but especially the mamas, we don't want them stressing. So I told her, you know what? We're, we could meet you halfway. We could meet you in Hendersonville because we were gonna socialize one of our puppies. So they really weren't interested in a puppy. She just followed us on YouTube and wanted to, wanted to come and see us because you know they were gonna be here for a few days and make it a day trip, which I get. So I told her, let's do that. So we set up a time, I went ahead and finished my video, got it posted, and then went ahead and got Miss Purple, bathed, blow dried. I already had trimmed up her face and stuff, but did like everything, just got her all done. And I recorded it. So we were about a week late of doing this video, but I went ahead and made sure we recorded everything so I could put it together. But let's go ahead and show you getting her ready. And then we're gonna get in the car and you can see how sweet she is. And then we're gonna go meet this family to let them love on her. And this is where the story gets interesting. So here is our precious girl. <laughs> She is just gorgeous and so sweet, but we got her in the groom room, got her all trimmed up, did her nails, did the hair on her pads, did her eyes, just got everything prim and proper, and then got her in the tub. So we're getting her wet down. Now we're getting her all soaked up. She's doing a good job. And then rinsing her out. So sweet. <laughs> and then we're putting her back in her clean area just to dry off a little bit by herself. And then here is where the previous video was gonna start. Hey guys, Billy Jenkins here with Silver Creek Doodles. We're gonna take Millie and Pickle's purple collar female to town and do a little bit of socialization today. So now we take a potty break before letting her meet this family. <laughs> Such a good girl. I love it. Don't give puppy kisses. She's so sweet. Oh, you are such a sweetheart. Oh, where are you going? Oh, oh she's happy. Oh, happy. no. <laughs> oh, my. The Oh my! Haley's like, oh my He's got face hair like you. <laughs> what do you think, Haley? Oh, what do you think? Hey, pretty girl, hey, darling. <laughs> what do you think? Oh. <laughs> the little baby girl. Oh. <laughs> So 
So we ran into TJ Maxx and I bought her a little bed and some more shampoo to try. And then here she is just posing. What a sweet girl before we hit the road again. Once we were back home, this was her favorite place to be. So after meeting this family and letting them love on this little girl, they showed me a picture. So they, it was kind of funny because the husband was loving and kissing on her and she was crazy about him. And I think it's the beard because I know when Toby holds them, they do the same thing just because they, they love that facial hair. But it's kind of funny because they showed me a picture and this is the picture here. They showed me of a dog that they had lost not long ago and it was kind of like, oh my gosh, it looks the exact same. So crazy thing is we weren't trying to sell this puppy. Of course, we were trying to make a video of socialization to maybe find her a home for people that follow us, but they ended up, you know, seeing her and falling in love and they texted me and said, we want her. And I'm like, oh my goodness, like it's a match made in heaven absolutely perfect like I just I just can't believe it so she was here for another two or three days and we needed to of course I don't let my puppies leave here without smelling scrumptious I think that's the word I always use in my videos so thankfully you know we had already trimmed her up got her hair and all of that done but we had actually bought a new shampoo at TJ Maxx that same day. So I thought, let's go ahead and try it out. But went ahead and was gonna get her all bathed again. So got her in the tub, got her wet, got her shampooed, got her rinsed out, got her towel dried. And of course, this shampoo smelled really good. And of course, everybody asked me what shampoos that I use. I do have a list of ones that I use. There is one specific that I'm like total hands down have to use it, but we're gonna have a video coming up about that next. So it's not gonna be in here, but it's gonna be in another video. But you know, just something that smells good. I've never had dogs with skin issues with, you know, dry coats or flaky. And I always tell my families, bathe your dogs once a week. And you know, it's not gonna dry there. Obviously you don't wanna use Dawn dish soap every time. You wanna use something like we use for our hair, something that's good and that smells good. But anyways, let's go ahead and get back. So we got Miss Purple, now Miss Kimber, got her all cleaned up, got her ready to go. And we actually were gonna meet them in Columbus to kind of help them through their ride. You know, help them, they didn't have to drive an extra way because they were going to Charleston. It was a good like five and a half hours from us to Charleston where they were staying. So we didn't really wanna have to make them come out of the way. So here we are meeting them again. Oh my goodness, you're just so excited. Oh, okay. <laughs> Look at Haley over here getting love by dad. Just making sure she gets her attention. <laughs> She's getting love. <laughs> hey. She goes, what is that thing, mom? <laughs> Good girl, Miss Camber. You get to go home. Sweet girl. Such a cutie. All right, Miss Haley. We'll see you later. <laughs> so I'm so happy that Miss Purple, Miss Kimber, and I wore my purple shirt that actually my nan got me one time. But I wore this purple shirt in, in this video for her because she is just 
so sweet. Like, I just cannot believe that our sweet girl that is just, she's so well-mannered and doing so good. And they've had her for a little over a week. She is doing fantastic. I'm just, I'm so, so happy. Not only that she wasn't the most flashy colored or blue eyes or anything like that, but she actually seemed like she was the best temperament of the whole litter. And it makes me so happy. And it's like, it almost makes me sad about the looks because I do want my families to pick per temperament, but I get people want something specific, but she was absolutely perfect. So I'm going to share some videos here at the end of over the last week of how they've been with her and some videos of her playing fetch and all of that stuff. And then I'm going to go ahead and finish this video out with don't forget to hit that subscribe link and give us a thumbs up if you like these videos and we'll see you next time. Bye. Okay. Come on. Oh, that's a good girl. Give me that. Give me that. Let go. Let go. Let go. Ready? Get it. Get it.